Alright, hello, and welcome back to Let's Play Mod Fallout in Vegas. This is James Seth Lynch, and I crashed. The game crashed, and, uh... Yeah, I had to revert to an earlier save, because I forgot to save in between videos. And yeah, I made some different trading decisions since I waited instead of sleeping, so I had sleep deprivation, so I didn't have enough gun skill to do that, so we have a lot of caps and no good ammo. Yeah. Hi, mister. I hope you're doing fine today. Where are your parents, kid? Are you, you here all alone? I don't have a mama or papa anymore. I see them sometimes when I take off my medicine, but they can't stay. I'm pretty used to being on my own. I'd like to see what we have for sale. Oh, I don't sell things, mister. I sell thoughts. So, you sell thoughts? I can take off my medicine and do some thinking. People say it's real interesting. I don't know, because I never hear it. Some people say that it's a gift. Other people say it's the kind of thinking anyone could do if they watched more than they talked. I don't know which is true. I see a lot. I think a lot. There's a lot to hear through the 188, too. That maybe accounts for the thinking. What is your medicine? How do you take it off? This thing on my head is headache medicine. It works real good, except I can't think when it's on. Really think I mean. I'll pay a thou I'll pay a hundred caps to hear your thoughts. Great. What do you want me to think about? I can think about you, here, or everywhere. What do you want? Mm. Do you thinking about here? I need to take off my medicine. Local, local. The here and now. Little of interest. Things to buy. False hopes and regrets watered down, washed down in dirty glasses. With regret comes a girl, smiling sad, brown robe, name Veronica. Half here, wraps her and her heart up like a pack. In the pack, a key, some say. Forecast, cloudy with a chance of friendship. Ouch, thinking small only hurts a little, but it's a sharp pain. There's another hundred caps. I want to hear your thoughts again. Sure. I could do some more thinking. What should I do my thinking about this time? You're thinking about everywhere. Let me take off my medicine. Bull and bear over the dam at each other's throats. But a light from Vegas? Ball spinning on the wheel. More than two at the table. Placing bets. All lose in different ways. A dam of corpses. Towns of corpses scattered across the sand. But whose? In what shares? Even the dealer doesn't know. Forecast, a rain of blood will flood the desert and not purify it. Blah. Thinking about everywhere always makes me feel a little sick. Sure, I... Do you thinking about me? Okay. Let me take off my medicine. Your face does the thinking. Two to the skull. Yet one gets up. Odds are against you, but they're just numbers after the two to one. You're playing the hand you've been dealt, but you don't let it rest. You shuffle and stack, and a gamble. A gamble that may pay off, but how? Forecast, rapidly changing conditions. A lot of thinking, most of it in your face. It's almost shouting at me. Sorry if I said anything weird. Hmm. And for thoughts I can pay you for? Sorry, sir. All that thinking has made my head hurt. I don't think I'll be doing any thinking for a long time. Alright. We made a kid decide to not think anymore. Hey, you know it's illegal for us to gamble back home? The government wants to keep us poor. Uh, don't bother me, please. Your friend seems too civilized for a place like this. Weather-wise, huh. it's such a lovely day. What's up? I really have more important things to Just do. Just say I the really words and we'll be the hey. first out to walk. You hear the Polko losers around Bay. here complaining how they lost their shirts on the strip? It's, it's perfect pathetic. for a flying Don't bother me, moon. please. They huh. say 
Back home, we don't wait. You hear the losers around here complaining how they lost. After I win big, I'm going to buy my friends dinner at that fancy gourmand restaurant. I saw ads for it back home. Huh. Everyone wants to win big. But no one ever does. Story of Vegas. And I really like this gun. I think I'll actually go with Commando instead of Cowboy. <laughs> I like that jamming animation. And I know I just do. Hey there. Need anything? Right. I'd like to see your wares. Sure. Here's what I've got. Hey, if it's free, I'll take it, even if it's junk. Alright, also, I, um... Uh, left someone behind. And the reason is... Morning. What's up? Oh, she's glowing. She's freaking glowing. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. Seriously, I I don't know if you can see this. Man, I, I love my guns. I know the brightness has turned down a whole bunch after all the converting, but she's freaking glowing. It's weird. It freaks me out. But it's cool. Howdy. Hey, what's up? I've never seen a robot like that before. Yeah, all these destitute Morning. travelers and travelers with all this dialogue. Yeah, I think that's cut content from the specific uh, outside bets for New Ve Fallout New Vegas cut content. And I'm really liking it. I can't wait to get to Freeside because Freeside uh, had a whole bunch of cut content. The, the, this mod adds it all back. Or at least tries to. Because uh, they had to cut a whole bunch of these guys because. Dun da da da! Xbox and the consoles, which will forever just hold down gaming with their pathetic processing power. So that they have to cut it all out. And us PC users can't enjoy the cut content. We can't enjoy that content, even though we have the processing power to use it. Uh, I, I I really hate the consoles, by the way. The PS3 and the Xbox 360. Railroad bill. Railroad bill. Oh, that bromming got fucked up, man. Ants, yeah. We're gonna stay. I avoid the killing of ants for... Uh... Religious reasons. It just... Yeah. Yeah, ants are kind of like the, the cat... For us, the... Answer to us what cows are to the Hindus, I believe it is. Something like that. That's the best metaphor I can explain in a short sentence. Because I'm not going through the whole thing as to why. Okay? We don't kill ants. They're very, very much like people. They're social. They communicate with each other. And they're yeah. I don't like, oh god. That. Oh 
All right. My armor is in dangerously low condition. Did I get... Oh, I guess I got hit by that. Stray shot or something. Uh, I guess I should uh, upgrade to leather armor reinforced. We actually skip normal leather armor, what do you know? Uh, this stuff looks weird. Kinda cool. Looks the same in first person. I actually no, I'm not gonna wear this stuff. I'm gonna I left my my metal armor, didn't I? Crap. I need that stuff. I need my metal armor. Freaking lightweight metal armor. What's so dangerously? I guess it was just the lightweight leather armor. Ah, uh, there's Helios One. You can see the tower and all that. I'm trying to sneak by front there. Okay. I I I just I like I've used this gun a lot because it's a good gun. It's decent. Uh, strangely, the NCR service rifle. <laughs> Still, it's only good because you know it's the ammo conservation. Five fifty-six is pretty darn common. But I should be exchanging this for some sort of automatic. Six, can I borrow a smoke? I'm all out. All right. Okay, okay. Um, this place is uh, going to take a long time to crack. I can tell you that. So I will see you guys in the next in the next episode. This has been James Seth Lynch. Bye.